when they used to break the big piece of coal with the with the flue rate, they just used to hit it and it fell apart. It would leave like um, a hole in the centre, but it was glowing. The fire of the fire, it was glowing. And my dad used to pick you up, sit you on his knee, and say, "Now I'm going to tell you a story. You see that now? That's a furry's cave. Can you see the furries? Look, and a spark would go across, and it would go like that." <laughs> Because, oh, Fernie, where is it going? <laughs> the story be a silly bit, isn't it? And he used to tell these elaborate stories about that cave. It was lovely. You know, he'd sit on his knee for about an hour and he'd just elaborate on this story, you know. That's where the furry sleep. Did you see one then? Did you see that little spark? Well, that was one furry. So you've got to be good or else there'll be no more sparks in that cave. You know, and he would just go on and on and on. These, But, but you couldn't afford... To buy all the books and no. that, you just got one at Christmas. So my story time was always around the fire.